Round three. Twat versus not name Fireball. I almost said not Fireball. <laughs> I'm bad. Name Fireball going Captain Falcon. Twat going Kirby. He's going the best color of Kirby. I would also say Twat is not allowed to lose because he's using the best color of Kirby, but I haven't been a Kirby main since 64, so... Yeah, technically I also played Falcon in 64, but this was not the best color of Falcon. And it's still not the best color of Falcon. I don't even think that color was in 64. Either way, we start off named Fireball, getting some decent damage on Twat. Twat going Kirby, trying to find something. Almost gets... Ooh, nice dash attack, bringing Twat back in this. Twat gonna run up and shield, gonna fear. Fade away, yes. The Falcon Punch, I don't know what the point of that is, because... The battle just tried it! And then died! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, all right. Okay, Twat came here to clearly um, have fun. He came here to have a lot of fun. He came here to try to style, and he's getting styled instead, apparently. Oh, no. Name Fireball has been getting a little comboed a little bit from Twat here. Another F tilt. Twat goes well. Oh, B to knock him away. Another one. Gonna parry it, though. Oh, the knee not gonna be enough to kill yet. Twat's still at low percent for a Kirby. Gonna make it back. Oh, the up B. Twat taking a lot of damage there. Almost out of his second stock, 90% on Kirby. Kirby's very light. Falcon, not so much. Gonna miss the down air. Gonna miss it twice. Bad position, but the down air does not. Expect it to have to go higher than that. Gonna get the... Oh! Up B. That gonna kill? No. Going for the... I almost said going for the suck. God damn it. I've been corrupted by this generation. I've been corrupted by this younger generation. I have... Ooh, another back here. NFB taking a very sizable lead here. Twat gonna hit an up here. Gonna try to hit a charged F smash, but NFB not gonna fall for it. Not gonna fall for it again. Twat looking hard for those F smashes. Not gonna get it. Gonna get an F tilt instead, though. NFB looking, playing very much, much more cautious. Trying not to take damage. Trying not to lose his stock. Twat gonna use an up tilt. Cannot combo at this percent. NFB living. 9, 185. Back here, definitely gonna take it. However, Twack is literal. He's, he's gonna look for Kirby side. Twack is looking for Kirby side right now. This man is seriously looking for Kirby side. Gonna get it down here. Oh, nice. Oh, nice combo. 69% on NFB. But NFB. Oh, looks for another down here. Not gonna find it. Up B. Gonna push him away. Twack trying to put himself back in this game, but 852 damage already. Goes for another. Oh, the down here connects, and that's gonna take it. NFB taking game one. I don't know what Twack's game plan was that entire game, but um, saving your mates, you're in winner's side. Saying in winner's side is more important than saving your mains, if you ask me. <laughs> That's all I will say. Let's see what's happening right now. <laughs> All right, game two. Here we go. There's a lot of weirdness happening in in um the Discord right now. That's all I'm seeing. I'm I'm just trying to keep up with everything, but obviously I can't. Um, uh, Mike, what happened to your match? Um, all right, confirm the match results and then we can move on there because, um, I might have to stream name Fireball twice in a row or twack twice in a row because MJ is already here. MJ is already here. Well, there's no one else on the other side yet. You and Tommy have to battle for the 15? Wait, did you both lose at the exact same point? Oh, God! Oh! Why are you saying that Tommy's gonna lose the bike? 
Why are you saying Tommy gonna lose the mic? You never know. Tommy might upset it. Tommy could upset it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Twack? Twack just pulled out his main main. He didn't even say he's saving his main. He said he's using his main main. Here we go. Twack, I'm the Donkey Kong. NFB on the link. Will Twack bring out the actual main? Make a difference or will NFB up? Advance 2-0 right now. NFB has a sizable lead here, 81% to 25. How will Twack? Oh, Twack! Oh my God! Twack gets a decent DK combo and is then hit. Oh, 116. That's a ton of damage on. Recovers back to stage. F tilt. Oh, dash attack. Twack. Oh my God! I almost thought that was NFB stock gone. I was so sure his stock was gone just now. Twack looking to try to end it with that up throw, does not get it. NFB looking for some, oh, that could be a dash attack, no, nothing. Oh, the boomerang may have just saved NFB's life. Oh, no dash attack, oh, no, Twack's gonna go for it again. Oh, but NFB matches, gets the fear, doesn't take the stock. Ooh, gonna get a hit. Welcome in, Yamil. Oh, the F smash though. Twack taking that first stock. Exactly. Oh, Mike looking. I, mean, I said Mike. Twack. NFB quickly evening up the stocks here. Twack sitting. Slight lead in percent. Gonna get an up here. Gonna get the dash attack to end it the other way to the, the bomb hit. Gonna grab. Oh no. Oh my god. Twack is doing him dirty. Twack is doing NFP dirty. Twack is saying, nah, bro, I'm taking this win. I refuse. I am taking this win. Twack is like, nah, 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 nah. I'm not here. To, the one game with my main, I am winning. I'm, I don't care if I have to do the most degenerate shit. You're not ready to attack? Unfortunate for you. I'm taking that stock whether you like it or not. But right now, NFB using the best near in the game. Link's near. I say the best near, but I mean the most unfair near. That shit can stop charge shots for some ungodly reason. While my near, I just get killed for it. Yoshi near doesn't stop charge shots, so why does Link's want to? I don't hear that he has iron boots on. That shouldn't mean anything. Oh, that actually hit. That's gonna do it. Twack takes game two. All right. Toon Link, arrow stops charge shots. <laughs> you know, I'd feel bad if I didn't hate fighting Samus. I would legitimately feel bad if I didn't hate fighting Samus. But I made Yoshi. I hate Samus. Samus Yoshi is awful. <laughs> Samus Yoshi is probably like the worst match in the entire goddamn game as far as I'm... For me, it's not the worst match in the game. Like, Ganondorf probably has that with someone who's really floaty or something. I don't know. I don't pay attention to Smash that much anymore. I just know Yoshi Samus feels like I'm dying. Yoshi Shulk feels like I'm dying. Is there anyone else that I really hate fighting besides those two? Those two stand out for me. I know other people hate other matchups, but those two, for me are awful. I've seen people call Lucina. I'm like, nah, we don't lose to Lucina. I think Tommy might be DQing. I haven't seen him. He's on Smash, playing them on. He should. He might be doing Elite Smash. He might be doing Elite Smash or something. I don't know what he's doing, but. Or he might be away from keyboard at the worst time. But here we go. Game three. Oh, that means he's probably out. I can't do anything about that at that point. 
I legitimately can't do anything about that at that point if he gets DQ'd like that. I mean... Here's the thing, right? Mike, what do you mean you get the 15? You're fighting for... You actually... You don't... You don't get the 15. You get the 25. Or did you forget how this works? Waters and Tommy have to fight for the have to fight for the 15. All right, Twat goes Mario, NFB goes Ike. NFB gonna start off this match. I feel like Mario's similar-ish to Yoshi in a lot of ways. So when he when Yoshi gets out range, I feel Mario is very similar in that. And that's how this Ike matchup feels. Like it's not bad, but you have to play very carefully to get around it. So with Ike, they can kind of just jump, spam their near, throw out up ears, and as long as they're doing it at a safe enough distance, they'll get those hits. And that's all they really need to just start racking up damage. And Ike hits very hard. So, just like he does in his game, <laughs> in all honesty. So at that point, all the Ike has to do is land one good up ear, one good back ear, one good move to secure it. So Twax is gonna have to find some way to make this happen here. Aether, that might kill. Yes, it does. Mini Ganondorf? I wouldn't say he's Mini Ganondorf. He's... He hits very hard. He is slow, which is unlike his game, in all honesty. But the thing with Ike is that his main thing is his range. The scariest part about Ike is his range. Ooh, F-Smash. Gonna side me over. Ooh, gonna get another hit here. See? Just like that. Black is just getting straight up outranged the entire time here. Finding it very hard to get in. Every time he tries to approach, he eats a fear, he eats a near, he eats something. Makes it very hard to approach. Another one up here. That's another stock off for Twack. Ike is a very... Ike has gotten better in Smash games as Smash has gone on. This is probably the best iteration of Ike. At the end, oh my god, Twack almost put himself in a very bad position there. But Twack down two stocks. NFB still sitting there pretty. Third and five. All, all of three stocks, Mac. Twack. Oh, tries for the flood. Doesn't get it. Ooh, gonna get another fear. Dash attack. Fireball. Oh, went for the up smash to try to take the stock. Aether. And fi finally finds the F smash. Oh, back here. Gonna find it. No up here is not gonna hit. Oh, back here. Twack's in deep trouble here. He's at 105. NFB sitting at zero. And the fear. Mario somehow manages to survive there. Twack makes it back. NFB not able to predict what Twack's gonna do. But has a big advantage. He can just keep swinging that big sword. Twack has to approach. Twack is far behind. Has to find our approach. Doesn't have the range. So has to... Go into Ike Swing, find an opening, and unfortunately for Twack, he does not find the opening, and NFB takes it two to one over Twack, and Twack has used his main main Donkey Kong. NFB advances to a winner's semi to winner's, or is it winner's final?